It's groaning and complaints as Lagosians witness day four of the lockdown. Our correspondent Mary Chinda, who visited a food market in Lagos Island, reports. It's day four of the lockdown in Lagos following the outbreak of the coronavirus disease across Nigeria. This is a temporary market put together by the Lagos state government to ensure that Lagosians around this area can actually have access to food within the 14-day period. A little challenge here is that persons who have come to buy food in this market complain that the cost of buying food stuff is even higher. I came to the food market. I came here to get something. When I get inside there, I saw what is going on. I didn't be able to get anything that I went to. I came here to buy beans and rice. Unfortunately, what I came here for, I didn't see it. If you can, if you think I'm lying, you can go inside there and check it yourself. I didn't even come here to collect it free. I came to buy with money. Still yet, I didn't see anything. The price is affordable, but some as the price is still high. Although we use the opportunity to buy, because even you go outside to find it, you cannot see some of those things that we are picking for our children. And we need to survive. We cannot stay at home without food. So that is why no matter how we cost or cheap, we have to manage and get for ourselves. It's just, I don't know, if, I, if it's like this for middle class people, I don't know what it will be like for people that can't afford to eat, as in, and this, this, I mean, shock, as in coming in here, I expected that there will be a lot more, but clearly this, the place is empty. And most of the people that I saw coming out, they're complaining that the stuff, the things are expensive. So they can't even afford. A lot of people are going out with empty. I was almost going to turn back, but I thought, no, let me come in. So most of these guys, they can't even afford to buy, they can't even buy the stuff they want to buy. The Ancola said they are sharing something free. When we come to the gate, then tell us, say, we buy a ticket. Eh? I don't know why they don't call us for. And see the situation where they keep us. They don't no pay salary. And they keep us for house. They say stay for house. And they don't no share food. And the promoter said they will give us some money. They don't no, we don't see anything. Other traders express their willingness to stay at home beyond the 14 days if only government can come to their aid. If they say me to stay, Reach two weeks, I'm um, for more than that. I'm out to stand on it. So, if there's no money and I'm not feeling fine, I will take it. I will take it myself. You understand? So, that's the thing. Now, they said there's corolla that we should stay at home. Government did not help us, they did not give us anything. So, they did not provide food for us. And they said people should, that they should give us food and money, we did not see anything. So, now I have to come out and give my, my children their at home and I have to feed them for food. So that's why I'm outside. Ending it easy at all. Because before we used to buy this for 100 naira, now 200. Ubu, 50 naira, 100 naira. So it's not easy at all. We are not enjoying it. That's all. We are not enjoying it. We just plead to the government to try and do something. We are not the same, you know? We are not the same. There's no how. We, we, we are just managing. There's no money. So now everything increased. So there's nothing we do. The government should just try try and do something. 